I even forgot to introduce myself. First of all, my name is Greg Kidder. You can call me Greg. Not Graham, not Greg. Greg, like the color Greg. The like 50 shades of Greg. Yeah. But yeah, I'm Greg. And I'm just that guy. You know what I'm saying? I'm just that guy that you just call your whole family. <laughs> Play. Tell us a bit about doing these traps. What, what, uh, what do these traps do? These traps, basically, me personally, wants, normally to everyone, it allows you to squat heavier, it allows you to stay safe. You know what I'm saying? Because when you strap them real tight, it keeps your knee tight. Me personally, it's not um, separate because of my knee injuries, it helps my knee to stay. You know what I'm saying? Should I go as heavy as I can today? Should I hit maybe 200, maybe let's see how we feel. You know what I'm saying? So, should I get 10 rest of this, yeah?
Go Zizi. Easy what? Put up a more. Easy what? Let's get it. I'm hungry. Let's get it. You didn't eat before you came to the gym? I did, bro. I feel like I didn't eat properly. I had some porridge and burger and tuna. And I had a flipping butter shed. And muffin here, bro. I should just eat. Eh. Man eats too much. How many times a day do you eat? About six. six minimum five. It has to be minimum five. So for the viewers watching at home, yeah. Um, what would be the let's say if your workout is at six, uh, what time would you recommend having your meal before uh, pre-workout? What I, actually, I'm talking about the actual meal. The extra meal. It has to be at least. I'll say an hour before. Now, me, I'm different. I can have a big ass meal. Right, I prefer to have a big ass meal right before I train. That is just me. Many people are like, yeah, I need to digest my food. I don't know that. I can eat and come and hear this bit. I prefer that because I just feel, I feel full and it allows me to lift more. So, but I would say an hour before, and like a uh, small before you train, you know what I'm saying? It can be a muffin, it can be a banana, but a proper meal, I think that's before. For you out there, but for me, I got me straight before the session. You know spoke yeah. about having the meal an hour before. Yeah. Uh, my question is, how big should that meal be? Heavy, medium, light? I would say. For the average person. For the average person. I would say eat as big as you can. You know what I'm saying? Because I eat about three pay, nearly five thousand calories a day. So I'll say eat as big as much as you can. It has to be big. You want to get big. So eat big. Leave that small boat for your little bubble. Leave that small boat for the dog. Get that big ass plate. You know what I'm saying? The big man plate. And the food that play up. You aren't gonna die. You aren't gonna die big. <laughs> eat that food. Talk us through, um, through that one. That's what I tell people. It's not about your head, man. Because as soon as you, your head says no, you mess up the whole thing. I'm grinding my shoulders, and my head said no. So my legs go scared. That's what I'm saying. Before you lift, get in the zone, get in your head, and just close your eyes, not your eyes, in your head, and then. Because it starts from there. Your stress is not flipping legs, you are. It's your mindset. <coughs> the leg session, we done some squats, some leg press, some lunges, some leg curls, you know, it's just, it was just a quick one today, some of the moves that I do for legs, you know, I hope you guys enjoyed it, I enjoyed it, with a lot of pain, you know, loads of pain actually, but no pain, no gains, you know what I'm saying, you know the drill, you know the vibes, but yeah, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, most importantly, make sure you subscribe, share it, send it to a friend, and then and the, tell your friend to send it to his friend. Tell that friend to tell him, you know I'm saying, let's keep it going. But yeah, I will see you guys on the next video. Peace.